Greetings, Prison Affairs. <laughs> Greetings, you two. Thank you for joining me. I'm out here today in this beautiful weather to introduce you to my new work, He Said, She Said, The Female Perspective. Amen. Let's start with the book cover. Um, I did a little sketch. Let me show you here. I did this sketch years backwards because I'm filming myself, but you get the idea. I did this sketch and I gave it to my daughter, Chrissy Poo, and she took her graphic education and came up with me a cover for my book. And this is it. <gasps> he said, she said, the female perspective. I love it. I love it. Thank you, Chrissy Poo. I'm gonna use that for the thumbnail so you can see it right in the thumbnail. Anyway, I got some new glasses here too. Also, Chrissy gave me for my birthday. Thank you. Now I can see. I got some notes here too, so I can try to stay on track. I'm getting a little scatterbrained in my old age. Even with the glasses and the notes, I still might be all over the place, but that's okay. We press on. Oh, my Lord, I've been out here for a while. I'm getting hot, um, thirsty. I should have brought some water. I have did this about 15 times trying to get it right, but <laughs> there's no such thing as perfect. So we're going to keep going. Mistakes, whatever. I'm ready to go. Anyway, He Says, She Said is a title I chose to reiterate the back and forth between text messages and it's called the female perspective because it's told from the female perspective we all already know when it comes to a story there's two sides uh, sometimes three sometimes four but um this work also could have had the um title of prison affairs part two because of so many similarities between that work and this work. Uh, if you haven't read Prison Affairs Part 2, I mean Prison Affairs, unedited, there is a uh, narration I've done on YouTube and also you can buy the book. It's still on Amazon and I still have copies. If you send me a message, I'll get you a copy. Um, the similarities between that work and this one is, of course, the same author, moi. And there is, um, Prison Affairs was based on a two-year journey. I'm going to make this book based on a two-year journey. There are going to be song mentions, and it's also a modern-day love story. Prison Affairs was a cautionary tale, but it was also a modern day love story. Prison Affairs was letters back and forth, but this is going to be based on text messages back and forth. We're going to bring it up to date a little bit. Also is similar is the quote by Tom Hanks on the back of Prison Affairs. It says, life is like a box of chocolates. You'll never know what you're gonna get. And it is my hope that in all you're getting, you get an understanding. Uh, you may get angry, you may laugh, you may cry, but in all you're getting, get an understanding. Also, Prison Affairs was a fictional story based on facts. Um, this story will also be a fictional story, but based on true facts. Uh, some of the chapter titles that is in Prison Affairs is going to carry on to titles. And he said, she said. The only difference here, one of the main differences is Prison Affairs was published. He said, she said, is exclusively a YouTube exclusive. And right now it is for Prison Affairs members only. 
you have to have the link to access the videos. Uh, yes, you have to have the link to access the videos, but you can feel free to share it if you want. Um, I may make it live. Oh, airplane. That's one of the uh, disadvantages of being outside, but it was so nice today. I wanted to come outside and do this and get some uh, real lighting. So, like I say, we're, we're pressing on. Um, feel free to share it, but you have to have the link to access it. I may make it public after I'm all finished, but for right now, it's a YouTube exclusive just for prison affairs members only feel free to share um, this is a draft because I am not finished yet I've been working on this for about six months and um, I keep going over and over the same thing over and over trying to get it perfect but there's no such thing as perfect and I am not finished yet so right now I am sharing the draft with you. Um, please be aware that the chapters may be uneven, maybe six pages on some, 10 pages on some, but the chapters may be uneven. But also I've noticed too in rereading what I've written, some of it sounds like poetry. Uh, it has a, a flow to it. Uh, it has a poetic flow some of the words rhyme and and how they connect um so i'm looking looking at this work as like uh extremely long haku <laughs> let's just make this an extremely long poem okay and um one thing i did notice in looking at the narration of prison affairs i was all over the place I mean, some I did inside, some outside, some was in my car, some was at home, in bed, um, some of them was dressed, some was in jammies, it, I was all over the place. But um, we're going to focus now on just the words. So I'm going to show the words so you can read along with me. And I also like to say if I'm reading too slow and you can always speed up the video in the settings and also you know you can adjust the volume if I'm too loud but you know use your settings to be at your own comfort and also I didn't want to be distracted I didn't want you to be distracted by the background like the gentleman that just walked past uh, that is a distraction okay yes that was a distraction the airplanes was a distraction but um, also I wanted to say if a good story don't put you to sleep it's not a good story <laughs> But that's okay. You just go back later, rewind, and catch up. But I think it's a good story. I think you'll benefit from it. Um, so there, there you have it. Um, let me see. I talked about the book cover. Um, thank you, Chrissy. Um, this has been very difficult very difficult because you know how you try to bring your art to life um, I'm having a hard time because I'm trying to bring life into my art I don't I don't know if you get what I'm saying but I'm trying to take true facts and bring it in to my work so, in essence, this will be a fictional story based on facts, just like prison affairs. So, uh, feel free to like, share, comment, subscribe, all that jazz. And uh, once again, I thank you for joining me. Please look forward for the prologue. 
I've got the prologue finished so I'm going to go ahead and put that out there and I am trying to finish up on chapter one so you could have that also and I'm going to try to introduce at least one or two chapters each week if I can keep up with that pace but um, like I said just wanted to get this out here get that get this out there and um, thank you again for joining me um, I feel like I'm, I'm missing something but we're not gonna do this again <laughs> Anyway, that's my time. Smooches, peace and blessings. Peace.